Take a look. Another Marquette County girls basketball team has made its way to the Breslin Center. The Nagani girls varsity basketball team departed this morning. TV 6s Tristan Kendrick tells us how community support has contributed to the team's journey. Despite the early hours, energy was high among the Nagani High School girls basketball team this morning. After beating Powers Catholic School from Flint Tuesday in Sault Ste. Marie, the team will play Edison Academy from Detroit at the Breslin Center in the MHSAA Division II state semifinals tomorrow. Head coach Mike O'Donnell says he's been overwhelmed by the community support. In the Sioux, we had a, a huge following and really think for a quarterfinal game that kind of helped us through. We've had multiple support uh, through monetary donations coming in. And, uh, it just never ceases to amaze me, even though, you know, it is, this has happened on the boys' side and the girls. The community always steps up, and it's just, it's really appreciated by our girls. O'Donnell also says this is the first time the girls' program has made it this far. It's pretty neat, you know, these, these girls, a lot of them have never even been inside the Breslin, so it's just going to be an experience in itself. We're going to try to soak that in today, get all the starry-eyed looks out of the way so that when we hit the, the floor tomorrow, um, we're ready to go and ready to play. Senior guard Ella Mason says the end goal is bringing home a girls basketball trophy like this, and she's been reminding her team all year to trust the process. Trust what has gotten us this far, and I'll just keep doing that, and we'll be all right. Another senior and forward on the team, Grace Nardi, says this experience has been both exciting and surreal. We always knew we were going to make it far. I don't know that we always thought we were going to make it this far. It's never been done before, but I think it, the Ishmael game was a big turning point for us, and they've been our biggest competition so far, so they really prepared us for this as well. Tristan Kendrick, TV6 News, Nagani. Nagani's game tips off tomorrow at 5.30 in the evening in East Lansing. Ishpeming is underway right now. We will have a live report coming up in just a few minutes.